that where you just kind of where you where, where you're closing for to meet with the enemy. So that's actually a really a really useful start bat uh, start of combat ability. Why, Camille? There's so much I want to tell you. Why do you have to go away? Judo! Welcome back! Play! Play too! You're both looking pretty happy. Considering at the end of my series, you were both dead. That's because we're alive today because you saved us. Now we're not going to die no matter what. Well, you both put in a lot of effort, too. Judo, go on and compliment them. You know, Mondo, you were on the Rock Calium, too? Thanks for the backup. The way you brought in back even Amuro Ray when we thought he was missing in action. That's called turning lemons into lemonade there, Nigel. Still impertinent as ever, I see. I'm assuming Judo's like doing a, a very jovial back pat while he's saying that. I'd prefer if you called me headstrong. Whatever. Now that you all and Mithril have come back, we can build up our own military strength again. Apparently, Londo Bell plans to come down and wait for a chance to trek back. Gamelus joined the Neo Zeon side, but we've got collaborators too. I hope we can stop the fighting before the flames of war engulf the whole world. That Laplace program went blank real quickly. What was that? Vanager! Audrey! My insensitive remarks kind of put you on the spot, didn't they? Oh, that? Don't worry about it. I'm not unsure at all anymore. Decided to fight at my own free will. Banneger. So that's the situation, Audrey. Banneger may still be inexperienced, but I have but have faith in him. I know it caused a lot of trouble for you two today. I'm sorry about that. It's fine, it's fine. After all, I'm just inexperienced as you. We're all in this together, Banneger. Plus, I'm pretty sure all that beating you gave to the uh um to uh, to the Z Gundam and the double Zeta, that, that, that'll buff out. Absolutely. People here have natural talent. Cardius Vist must have known that, which is why he gave you that Gundam. But perhaps it should have come from Londo Bell. We don't have much time left. Hmm. It's been a while since I saw you smile like that. You're probably right. Ever since we talked about the unicorn, you had, you've had a troubled look on your face. Judo actually told me that I'm afraid of the psycho frame. Commander. That force repelled Axis sent me to another world. If only, but if only someone could use it properly, that something would definitely change. At least that's what I've come to want to believe. The unicorn, Banagher could control it. Not just Banagher. Judo, Hathaway, and Setsuna, and me too. That light the Gundam from another world showed. It certainly did look like the Psycho Frame. Chan, Chan, send the Psycho Frame materials to Ian on Ptolemaeus Two. Really? Like, like I just said, I want to believe that, that people can use that power properly. Got it. The one I'm worried about is Camille. Just why exactly did he show up? If he's not a member of Londo Bell, he must be fighting on his own. Alright, we have a couple new dialogue bits we'll get to, and... It's actually, we're getting pretty close to the... I mean, we're coming, coming close to the two-hour mark. That mission was re much longer than I anticipated. We may just wrap it up a little early. Also, I, I had a late start. Alright. Congratulations on becoming an ace pilot, sis. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. Wow, did you make the set all by yourself so you could talk to us ace pilots? It must have been hard work. Yes, but it's wholly worth it. I invite them here, it's because I need to talk at length with them. And I take it you want to interview me now. That's right, in particular, I'm interested in asking ace pilots like you about your insights on love. Love? Why that? Why here? Why now? I'm sorry, I screwed up on the voice for nine. Apologies. From what I've been able to ascertain, humans consider love to be the most important emotion of them all, yet I continually struggle to fully comprehend it. As such, I'm left with no choice but to ask them just how they define it. And I now I pose the same question to you, sis. Um, well, uh, I, I, I hate to break it to you, nine, but I'm really not the best person to ask about that. 
You should probably find someone else. Why is that? Well, I, 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 are, are you really going to make me say it? Because I, I I've never gone out with a, a guy before, so you get what I'm saying, right? Go to talk to somebody who got experience with that stuff. I'm no good. Ah! Poor sis, I didn't realize you were so inexperienced. Don't worry about it, sis. Once I figure out what human love is, I'll use my knowledge to find out, find, help you find someone who root, who makes you happy. Whenever this interlude happens with Kurtz, it's going to be hilarious. Commander Amaro. Oh, nine. What's on your mind? I took the liberty of re-investigating the connection between you and the Red Comet, Char as Noble. Just be careful. A lot of stories have been written about us that are completely without basis. What's your opinion of this guy they call Full Frontal? I'd like to hear, you, hear what your feelings are about someone who takes up the name of an old rival. To be honest, I'm not quite sure myself. By analyzing your battle with him, my tactical processing capacity was able to acquire data equivalent to 100 attack points. Did I act any differently from usual? No, you were your usual self. I see. I might actually have more negative feelings toward that guy than I thought. But this much I can say for sure. He is definitely not Char. I don't think he needs to become Char. What do you mean? Let's talk about this again after my thinking takes shape a bit more. A little more. Judo, what is it, Nine? What do you think of Audrey? What do I think? If things continue this way, I predict that a love triangle is going to develop between Banneker, Audrey, and you. And based on my observations, I'm expecting that another man will be added to the mix. Give me a break! What are we going to do if, if Banneker goes another rampage with the unicorn? So what are your feelings about that girl? I'd like to know, too! So would I! Mind if I listen in? What's with all of you? All this romance surrounding Judo, I wonder how many sides this love polygon is going to have. I wonder how things will turn out if that pilot Meridia gets thrown into the situation. Meridia? And Judo... Meridia, Judo... Like, in terms of how, like, characters feel about each other, Meridia, Judo, and... Um... Oh, crap. What's her name? I'll get her name in a second. Alright, some power parts. Build out. Oh, right, yes. Wanted to get the gain meter. Absolutely wanted to buy the gain meter. Um... Rue. Oh, I got LA. That's what Elo and Mondo. They have or they have no ships they're assigned to. Unfortunately, you can't assign. Oh, with the Re R Rizel. Well, um, customization. First things first. Now, we can look about upgrading the Unicorn. Actually, um... Great Mazinger. Finish boosting your armor and energy. You can tank better. Uh, Gundam Unicorn, um... One of the Gundams is a whole bunch of energy-based attacks. Wrong one. Um... Oh. 
right, the quant. I was going to upgrade the uh, energy on the quant. Because the quant, like, like half of its abilities are um, attacks. Not attacks. Half its abilities are um, uh, ammunition based, but the other half are energy based. Get the Quebleys, it's gonna be once I'm gonna want to use these in the future. And I'm running a tiny cash for those, so sub orders. Um, patrol. on a patrol. I need... Nope. Okay, none of the... Re so, it looks like the rest of the... Um... Crud. The rest of the Fulmill Panic crew is no longer available. Let's work on getting people up to uh, Ace. And then leveling up the Logies. And fill out the rest. Pack points. Akito is like two more sorties possibly away from getting an ace. Kincaid and Akito are close. All right, Kincaid's got... Proud Ace already. All right, he doesn't... All right, so... All right, so I need to start... Um... Picking up more um, ace ability, proud ace abilities to level up characters. We have characters who are like, who are now close to hitting ace again, and that'll probably be next. What my priority will be for next mission. Um, actually, wait, I do have the skills that I've already gotten. Though. Uh. Let's go take a look at, um, Sasuke. Concentration dash. Um, with potential L6, which is like new type, but not quite. Um, give him dash. Let's boost his movement some. Oh. 
Hang on a sec. My cat is trying to climb up on the shelf in front of the television. So SP up. I want to give that to somebody who... Sasuke skills are... We know intuition. Intuition is dodge. Yes, yeah, so actually, yes, I want to have him learn uh, SP recovery because that helps him build up. He keep doing uh, intuition because that's flicker and um, bullseye, which I want to be able to do that. And same with that. Um. Saparuda. Okay, Saparuda's got Proud Ace. Uh, also, Team Evasion up because his robot's squishy. I'm actually going to put this power on... Potosa's already got a ton of skills, but this is actually a good one for her to have. Because she's kind of in the back rank in a lot of fights. And the Poly 91 and the Kai Kai a lot, but they're also very maneuverable. Let's put some of the super robots that we can throw a bunch. We're probably going to play a bunch. Where's the... Amazing girl. You have the amazing girl. Just a little more movement. And that's a good place to wrap up now that we've straightened out everyone's uh, skill points. So... Next time, we are going to continue pressing the offensive against Zeon. And deal with and run into Meridia and the Titans and again and the Titans. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider packing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.